Adams and change this offense with. David Montgomery motions out of the backfield. The first play for the Bears is a toss to Montgomery. Made the first man miss, made another miss, and got nine. We figure a matter of time before he gets going. Second and six. Here comes Fields. Design run. Justin Fields, first down. And this is the hard part, right? You get an extra hat when you bring the quarterback in. You get the block there to seal. But look, he's got Cole Komet out in front of him. So now you're, you've extended it all the way down the field to the next guy. And you just keep pushing that responsibility, pushing that responsibility. Well, who's going to come up and make the tackle? It's getting that extra hat at the point of attack and then relying do everything on everything he and give up that first down on third and long to Justin Fields. Yeah, Fields has run for a first down on third down 27 times this year. He'll throw to the end zone. He's got a wide open man and a touchdown to Darnell Mooney. On third and eight, they throw for a 16-yard strike from Fields to Mooney. Uh, watch how they challenge the release right here. You go up the field, now you break outside. That's outstanding. D. Alford cannot get back into that play. It is not OPI. There's nothing going on there. The way that offensive coordinators and play callers have created challenges. He headed for a head coaching gig at the end of the year. As he's triggered the change in this offense. His quarterback Fields steps up and runs. And Justin Fields has a first down. Too much, a little bit too much juice on that one. Play action, first play of the second quarter. He makes Lorenzo Carter miss and runs for a first down. And that remains the most frightening part of trying to defend him if you're Dean Pease and any defensive coordinator that's got to face the Bears these days. I love what they say, though. you got to go take your shot, right? You, you can't come in and break down. This is the scary part right now. He's coming downhill. you got to go get him because not only is he fast enough to run away from you, he's big enough to run you over. And we've seen him do that a number of times during the course of the season this year. The knocked a line. Swings out. Fields over the middle. Cole Komet, oh! one hand block. <laughs> what a catch by Komet. Who is this guy? Justin Jefferson? No, Cole Komet, 26 yards. Brilliant. Not only a one handed catch, but watch AJ Terrell come off his guy and contact him in the middle of the one hand catch. Cole Komet, who's got five touchdowns this year, all coming over the last three games. He's been the biggest beneficiary of this passing game getting down in this second quarter. Fields has St. Brown, and he's got a first down. Equinemius St. Brown, who's been mostly involved in the running game as a blocker. He'll continue to ride the wave of Justin Fields, but to some wins. He's got the ball with blockers ahead, and he's got a touchdown. Untouched into the end zone. So Justin Fields, a passing touchdown, and now a rushing touchdown today. And again, it's just that it's 11 on 11 and you know, you get great blocking on the edge and, and it's really challenging. And you get down blocks and, and then you know, the offensive line is coming around. You got Braxton Jones, Cole Komet out front. David Montgomery. Equinemius. First half for the third and two. Fields again, same play the other way. He's got a seam and he's got a big one. Into Falcons territory. Longest run of the day for Justin Fields. Goes for 19 yards. There he goes again, number 19. This time he's going down inside. Here comes 71 and 85 instead of 70 and 85. Very similar to that touchdown run. You got David Montgomery out in front blocking. It's just hard. You're, you've added a hat at the point of attack. And that gets him through and into the secondary. Against a four-man rush, he's flushed. He takes off. There's a flag down, and Fields somehow squirts through there and gets a first down. Yeah. It, again, it, rush lane integrity, right? Watch this thing open up. Here's two guys right on top of each other. You lost your contain. You're outside. You should have been inside. Michael Walker, you didn't take your shot. You came to balance. You, With everybody else in the NFL, you might want to come to balance. 
Play action. Fields given time. Montgomery on the check down. David Montgomery lowers the shoulder, and boy, he's gotten a bunch after cut. Finds Claypool and has a first down. Second catch for Chase Claypool, just settled open underneath, and the drive continues. Fake to Montgomery. Throw for Komet. First down for the Bears as he's bumped out by Terrell. And, and your, your body is going to get worn down. Deep drop, deep routes, lets him develop. Good coverage, though. Down the sideline goes Montgomery and Fields spectacularly drops it in. On the move, fires a strike for a gain of 34. We've talked about this when we've had Chicago in the past. It, it, there's a couple of wild throws Ooh. from Justin Fields every game. It's not super consistent, but this is one of those wild throws. I love this. Sends him down the field, waves him down. Now watch this throw. I mean, that is tight coverage by Lorenzo Carter. That is a perfect last two games. They've called 22 pass plays in the fourth quarter, and he's thrown for 40 yards on those 22 plays. Third and long here. He'll look to throw. He's given time. Fields scrambles, keeps it alive. Magic from Fields. Justin Fields finds St. Brown. First down, like only Justin Fields can do. All right, we're going to have to put the tracker on him on this one. He had a, a one-yard touchdown run and traveled about 34 yards. He may have he may have about done that one on this pass play. You know, th there's something there, Joe, because he does not want to take off and run. You know, he, he's feeling his way through it. You know, right there, a normal Justin Fields, he's out. And he's going to have Equinemius St. Brown as a blocker in front of him. So, yeah, there's something going on where he's electing not to run. And he's using the guys around him to help him get through.